Hello guys, in this video I will show you how to play Demon Slayer the Hinokami Chronicles 2 for your PC. First go to your browser. And go to the sit web, I will put it in the description. And click download emulator. From this emulator, we will run the game. It will download automatically. When it done, go to the location where you downloaded the emulator. Click right click at the folder and click show more option. And go to WinRAR and click extract the file. And click OK. Now open the folder. And scroll down until you find Ryujinx. And double click at Ryujinx. And wait until it open. When you open, it will show you this message that you need a key to use it. Click OK and let's download the key. Now go to your browser. And go to the sit web, you will find the link in the description. Here we can download the key. Scroll down. And click download at the last one. Now, go to the location where you downloaded the key. And right-click. Click Show More option. And go to WinRAR and click Extract here. Open the file. And select those file. And right-click, then click Copy. Now, go back to Ryujin. And go to File. And click Open Ryujin Folder. Now, go to System Folder and open it. And pass the key files we copied before here. Now close this window. Next step, you have to download the firmware. Go to this web and download. Make sure to download the last firmware version. I downloaded before, so I will cancel it. Now go to the location where you downloaded the firmware. Right-click at the folder and click Show More option. And go to WinRAR and click Extract Files. And click OK. Now, go back to Ryujin. And go to Actions. And click at Install Firmware. And click at the second one and go to the location where you extract the firmware folder. And select it. And click Select Folder. Now click Yes. And wait until the installation complete. Click OK. Now the emulator is ready. Now, you have to download the game. You're going to find all links in the description. Now, go back to Ryujin. And go to Options. 
and open settings. Click Add and go to the location where you downloaded the game and click Select Folder. Click Apply and OK. The game will add automatically. Now run the game. If you've reached this point, don't forget to let me know if it worked for you in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.